Could this be the festival of Rotini? Uh, it could start slowly. Yeah. I was filling the pots <laughs> with an arbitrary amount of water. And then he comes over and he goes, oh, you didn't measure it out. You have to for the salt ratios. If I was making Velveeta at home, I probably wouldn't salt it anyway. And what? After all this time? And this is not much broccoli, by the way. Broccoli Lesnar. But it accumulates. I know, it'll uncue. I think when you're having guests over, yeah. that's a time to scrub the toilet. Sure. As if the guests will be like, huh, John poops in his toilet, I see. <laughs> you're supposed to put up a front that says, I don't actually use it. I don't, that's just for show. The bacon is, is very small pieces. Invisible pieces. But one of the most important parts of the table yes, here. Yes, it's not this stuff. I, I like make soup in the bathroom and work with it. Like the- <laughs> Do you actually use it? I do all the time. <laughs> Why in the bathroom? <laughs> now, wait, wait, stop. <laughs> are, are you dressed as a security guard? Yeah. I could walk into the bathroom. Oh yeah. And be like, and I'm cooking soup. <laughs> Andrew cooks food in the bathroom at work. We're going to be using an extension cord. You don't want it to be under the fire alarm. The water sprinklers will go off and that'll ruin the salt ratio. Passion a crude tool out of this cucumber. I can't use that at work unless I light a match under it. You're like, I can't bring this into a bathroom. We may have that exact problem. I heard recently from uh, Josh James in Seattle. Josh James. That they were going on sale where he was. Sale where he was. For <laughs> See this little happy dude? What looks like half of his brain shot off with a shotgun? It does. Frankie, could you check the box to see if it's dishwasher safe? Andrew, could you check the box to see if it's dishwasher safe? I, I, wow. It's got multiple functions. <laughs> Do you think more people would eat more beans if they were called frijoles here? Because it's fun to say frijoles. Yeah. Frankie frijoles. Here, I'll just do it, no, right? you're gonna burn your precious. I, <laughs> you just did, didn't you? That hurt. I'm sorry, Frankie. It was two in the morning. I was like, I just went to sleep. You don't have to apologize to the likes of this man. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ah! what did I do? I don't even have my mouth. I don't even have my mouth. I'm surprised you guys haven't murdered me yet. You're surprised we haven't killed you. <laughs> Excuse me, you were always the murderer in this arrangement. Oh, I was the murderer. The people who've made like 100 episodes of a show about mac and cheese. Yeah, they're the normal people. Yeah, that green screen stuff is pretty normal. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Donnie is a cute little princess. Now, waffle, I'm gonna give a kissy. So you gotta go way deep or you're gonna get burnt. Ow! <laughs> Did you lose it? Is he gone? I'll use another tool to extract it. <laughs> we'll get this lost in there. There we go. I'm gonna open up the ingredient hole. Oh, it's too hot to touch. Don't touch the ingredient hole. <laughs> Turn up the mic for Nina. Turn up the mic for Nina. Turn up the mic. Turn up the mic. Turn up the mic for Nina. Oh, I left the label because it, it, it's the weight. It's weighted yeah, it perfectly. Makes it makes swing. You show the camera though. Not me. <laughs> How you been? Well, I've been good. That's good. How's being pregnant? <laughs> a pound of cheese, American cheese. Amanda likes American cheese. Pound of American cheese. What do you mean I did it all wrong? I you said five tablespoons. It is actually five tablespoons. <laughs> so so anyway, shut up. How are those notes? Tough. Tough but fair. <laughs> <laughs> Things have gone modern. Things have gone modern. <laughs> what, what is so funny? Things have gone modern. <laughs> I mean, it's not the worst. It's not the first. It's not Fred Durst. Feliz Navidad. You said, oh, I do felicidad. Wish you a Merry Christmas. A fan had, had sent in. <laughs> I think his video got written off for its gut reaction, simplicity early on, opening the door for one of John's classic authoritative analyses. I don't like it. And I'm sure he has great recipes. I have great recipes too. You know, it's 1792, we all have daggers. Before al dente. Or before al dente? Maybe you should check one more time to make shizzle. When love puts it through the fire, when love puts it through the test, nothing cares a broken heart like time love is getting He's fine. He's okay. And the milk is okay too. A gallon of milk won't <laughs> wumping out on the floor. What? When I fix a big and it'll put it in a pancake. Bacon pancakes, that's what it's gonna make. Bacon pancakes. Bacon pancakes, make it bacon pancakes. Takes a big and it'll put it in a pancake. Bacon pancakes, that's what it's gonna make. Bacon pancakes. <laughs>
All right, it's just making a basic roux, making bacon pancakes. <laughs> we gotta make, we gotta make it bacon pan, no. Uh, <laughs> making pancakes, hi Zach. Making pancakes, that's how it's gonna make. You're making pancakes, making make bacon, bacon pancakes. pancakes. Oh jeez, almost had a bacon, a bacon pancake. <laughs> Could you cut the cheese for me, Frankie? <laughs> <laughs> Why couldn't I sample this before we bake it? You certainly can. I thought you said something about flour. Is it the kind of thing we can taste before we bake? It's gonna, it's got a lot of flour in it because they're gonna make the thing, so it's gonna taste like raw okay. flour. All right. be no, no, it's all done now, it's fine. Oh. You just weren't quite ready when you were gonna try to do this. Could you stir this oh, one I for me? I think you were mistaken. You know, I tried a noodle prematurely. I, I, I understand and I, I, I appreciate your commentary. Melt the butter over medium low heat, stir in the seasoning. <laughs> It's very white. Well, that's the white cheddar. So it makes sense that you'd want the source to be light. The source? These are gonna be real hot. Hotter than much. Hotter than. <laughs> hotter than much. Oh, that's f***ing hot. Mm, Oops. Oh, f***ing Christ. Let's right? go on. Yeah, burn my hand. In a rush, omit the baking step and sprinkle the hot macaroni and cheese with the breadcrumbs. Just throw the breadcrumbs in the trash can. <laughs> <laughs> Box crumbs. <laughs> crumbs. <laughs> crap crumbs. <laughs> throw them in the trash. Thank you. That was a little too. Squeak. <laughs> Hi, I'm Boring Chuck from Ohio. Do, 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 This one's at a royal. The other two aren't ready yet, so uh, we're just gonna have to wait. These are very clumped. I didn't get to stirring that quite fast enough. Just a big old clump, kind of like me. Normally there'd be a musical number right about now. <laughs> Doing the best you can, Chuck. <laughs> Quarter. <laughs> Very bland. It's about boring Chuck's speed. It's yeah. pretty good. But for boring Chuck, it might be too much. I don't think it's too much yet. It's actually got some cheese flavor. It's too much. <laughs> <laughs> Penises! Today on Boxback! We don't yeah. normally go into our territory. Yeah, cocks, dicks, <laughs> dumbs. You and that pubes way up there. <laughs> the only noodle with a heart on. That's not even clever. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a it's... stiff cock joke. <laughs> <laughs> this is whole brown rice pasta side. The sentence that John can't say. Whole brown rice pasta side. Side. Whole brown cheddar pot. <laughs> God, and yeah, the brown like... rice pasta bullshit smells like shit. <laughs> 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 it smells fucking awful. It's in my kitchen. Every week I gotta deal with this. Where did that goddamn eval? You think I like that? How come the box can't stand straight up? It keeps curving. <laughs> <laughs> There's the door. How's the whole brown rice pasta? Why didn't you smell? try some, Frankie? <laughs> yeah, the penis juice is very bright. These dicks are. <laughs> <laughs> I lost about 4% of my dicks. They're very limp. The dicks are limp. We might want to do something about the dicks. It's a limp. The dicks are limp. Why are they so limp? We might want to do something about the dicks. They're limp. They're limp. Cocks and penises and dicks. Cocks and penises and dicks. And dicks. Cocks and penises. Cocks and penises and dicks. <laughs> All right, it's a little funny, especially when you put two times of the scrote. And the shaft doesn't have enough girth to it. Really what you'd want to do is thicken the shaft edges and then it'll remain more solid when cooking. If I were to choose between something that tastes like dick and something that's shaped like a dick, well. Yeah, I'd take the shape over the taste. The old hat, it's retired. It was old hat. It was old hat. <laughs> I like that gag. What do you think? How does it look? Well, it's, it's like standing very erect. <laughs> Unique prep. That's what Nina said, and she gave me she gives the notes before the episode starts. Yeah, she rushes out with a headset and quickly tells us everything we need to know before we go on. Exactly, exactly. She's got like a little clipboard. <laughs> She's got somebody in her ear telling her the absolute latest facts. <laughs> Corrections for the teleprompter. So we've got a sachet. At this point, any cheese pouch is a sachet. Forever and ever, ramen. Little pipettes, he used to say. Little pipettes, yes, it was wrong. Okay. I was wrong. 
Mark it on your calendars. Both bot search. Both bot search. Both bot search. Okay, got the fourth pot. Everybody was really excited to see that you finally had a fourth pot. In actual fact, it was always a Lent pot. It was always a Lent pot. So the problem persists. I feel like that's a Ben Franklin proverb. It was always a Lent pot. It was always a Lent pot. Yes. You may thought he had four, but one was always a Lent pot. Ben Franklin, France, <laughs> 1896. Yeah. It was something that occurred to him after the Revolutionary yes. War. Let me just tell you how, why I think I'm qualified to, to apply for this job, okay? <laughs> That's why. When have we ever come across a box that was like, ba ba ba, no salt? Fine. Are you guys with me on this? I'm with you, I'm with you. <laughs> I'm also not really like in general a huge tomato guy. I have quality Ocean State job lot grated Parmesan cheese. Oxymoron? Gotta turn this down a little. Yeah, that is a little outrageous, truly, truly, truly. Well, it looks like the pesto is coming down a bit here, and we are gonna have a delightful amount of cheese sauce and pesto with sun-dried tomatoes. You have never had anything in your life. There you go. <laughs> You've never had anything in your whole life. You recall, you never cork it. You put a cheesecloth where the cork goes. What else do you do? You don't put it in the coolest part of the house, you put it in the warmest part of the house. Hope you're all ready for some odorific max. 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 Max, 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 max. What episode number is this? 82. I thought you were gonna go up. 82. 82. Max, max, 82. Leave it in the comments. I below. think. <laughs> it's actually 84. And there's a hypnotized angry chicken on the package. Teeth are bearing. I'm, I'm seeing teeth, chompers in there. So th those who listen to How Are We? Yeah. You know, all of those episodes. How are we? Yes. The, uh, the 30 of you that have listened to all of those. Oh, a jab at How Are We? <laughs> Suddenly somebody's, somebody's a star. We gotta fly them in, they gotta come in from far away. I don't see you driving anywhere. <laughs> you roll out of your bed, no into way. the bidet, over to the yes. kitchen. It must be South Korean, yeah. Yeah, like Kim Jong-un is packaging this himself. Cheese flakes. The third <laughs> highest ingredient, cheese Does flakes. <laughs> cheese flakes? <laughs> cheese flakes. Alexa, what is 550 milliliters in ounces? Alexa? Her name's Echo. Alexa, what's 550 cc in liters? Echo. It's not Alexa, it's Echo. Echo. <laughs> yes? You need to. Then you would have to repeat the question again. <laughs> you just say Echo after the fact. <laughs> yeah. You feel like you're teaching your parents how to use it. <laughs> when they're just constantly looking at it, they say something and then they go, Alexa. <laughs> Alexa, what's 550 cc It's not in Alexa! <laughs> Echo. See, now yes. you said the word echo, you asked the question afterwards. Mike, One what the f*** is this. going on? You're laughing at me. What are you laughing at? <laughs> How old were you at that point? Uh, 15, I don't know. How many boxes of Mac had you made? <laughs> Six. How many pots of pasta have you boiled? Three. And you didn't know that was too much salt? Jalapenos. Snoopingers! Snoopingers. He's like, if you keep making fun of my friend, you know. Ernest. <laughs> Mr. P. Worrell. It's not bad. It's not something I could eat, but it's not bad. The problem is the day after on the toilet, this is not gonna be pleasant. No. <laughs> no. I'm assuring you on that. The ring of fire. It's disconcerting to be on an episode of Box Mac and the stove is shut down. Just a cold abandoned a cold stove. stove. Cold stove. Cold, cold stove. stove. Cold stove. <laughs> Frankie has gone to the bathroom. I am on my own. I'm junked. Please buy my branded products and services. Please buy my bacon my spaghetti sauce, and my cheese. Yeah. My cheese is extra quality. A quick release. Of a steamed lamp. Steamed lamps? Steamed lamps. Steamed lamps. And it is watery as What am I supposed to do with that? Maybe they don't want to get any bigger. Maybe they want to be like Market Basket. They want to stay schnuckish. Don't we have to have an obligatory musical segment? Never break the chain, chain. I don't know the song. Would uh, we'll just go through the Guardians of the Galaxy 2 volume. Brandy, you're a fine girl. I know that song and I kind of like it. I don't know any words of it though. Fox on the run. Right away. Never a big fan of that song. It's not time to make a change. Just relax, take it easy. You're still young. I don't know that song at all. It's Cat Stevens, for f sake. <laughs> Zach's still singing it. 
all the time that I cried Keeping all the things I knew inside It's hard, but it's harder to ignore it This song sounds terribly sad. It is very sad. They were right, I'd agree But it's them they know, not me Now there's a way And I know that I have to go away oh, This song is awfully sad. <laughs> Jesus. I know. There you go. Okay. That's a lovely musical segment by Frankie. Do I need to go to Ooga Chaka to get us there? Yes. Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga, Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga. I can't Ooga Chaka, stop Ooga, this Ooga, feeling. Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga. Deep Ooga, inside Ooga, of Ooga, Ooga. me. Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga, Ooga. Girl, Ooga, you Chaka. just don't Ooga, realize. Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga, what you Ooga do to Chaka, me. Ooga, Ooga, Ooga Chaka, Ooga. When you hold oh. me in your arms oh. so tight, you let me know. Everything's all right. I'm hooked on a feeling. I'm high on believing that you're in love with me. I lost my other spoon. How'd I do that? I lost my other spoon, Frankie. I lost my second spoon. This is a really sad song. I don't know it. I lost my second spoon, Frankie. Where is my second spoon? I lost it on the moon, Frankie. I lost my second spoon. I lost it on the moon, Frankie. Where's my second spoon? Should we chest the noodle? Chest the noodle. We should probably chest a few noodles. Chest the noodle, chest, chest your noodle. Could you squeeze that cheese? We're doing this pre-pasta? Yes, that's the way to do it. That's the way I always do it. No. Yes, it is. <laughs> Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's how I always make them. I put the cheese in, then quickly throw the pasta on Really? Top. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Maybe it's just a detail you never thought about or noticed before. This is an incredible social experiment, this whole show. The directions are are wacky. I was gonna say fucking wacky, but don't, you know. Heat for one minute and then eat it. That's it. It's a heat and eat. An old heat and eat. Me and Jimmy Jay are gonna go get someone, go, go, go get an old heat and eat out. <laughs> Did you go to the bathroom and fought and come back? Yeah. Did it waft out? Yes, it's awful. <laughs> I knew it was <laughs> really bad. It's an RBF. <laughs> It's like class three. You should have gone outside. It's like trying to fart outside the car. It always comes in. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, now it's like hitting me. How did I go to you first and then me? Sometimes I don't, the pattern of a fart makes no sense, you know? That's the sort of thing that makes you think that you got away with it. Are you ready for beef stew? Let us know in the comments. Oh yeah. yeah. Are comment you, about beef stew. If you're eating something that doesn't, that tastes like beef stew but shouldn't. Comment below. Puffed up like a, like a cankle. Give it a little whiff. That's still my fat. I joked earlier that it might taste like clam chowder. It does actually taste a little bit like clam chowder. <laughs> Creamy clam chowder, al Alfredo Rotini. I'm not even gonna do an outro. <laughs> we gotta look at this dress because this dress <laughs> is amazing, right? Look, look at this. It looks like a noodle. It does look like a noodle. The theme of my Mac is things that they were gonna throw out at work lunches this past week. <laughs> Finally, boring chick from Ohio and boring chick, chick from, from Ohio, Ohio together at last. I put corn in the mac and cheese, which Frankie is pissy about, but... <laughs> <laughs> All right, it smells like tuna bad. Oh, it sure does. <laughs> well thought. <laughs> yeah, well. Anger you Kirby, hate. you go first. I hate tuna. This is a Cracker Barrel base, okay. sharp cheddar, with Cincinnati style chili. Everybody's talking about how my tuna mac sucks, but I had to make it with a broken freaking neck. We've got some fireworks Oreos, a package of fireworks Oreos. It's got pop and candy. It's limited edition, even though it comes out every 4th of July. This is the prize? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't think I truly deserve these until I face TV's Gary, a mac of his choosing. Oh! TV's Gary, we haven't found him. He's nowhere to be found. Nowhere to be found. Let me tell you about my client, EJ Massa. I'm fed up with this world. <laughs> <laughs> I go to it now instead of Kraft Three Cheese. Nah. -uh. Uh huh. Nah. -uh. Nah. -uh. Milk and butter. I think we all just have decided it's a given. Well, have you? Have you at home tried this? They didn't try it. Nah, they didn't try. They're grossed it. out by the concept. That's right. You know why? Because they belong to a cult. <gasps> a cult of milk and butter. <laughs> You just taught yourself about ghee recently. Yes. You didn't know what it was before that. 
Yes, but... He took a night class last week on this. <laughs> and now he's a doctor of it. The, the first stage of ghee butter. <laughs> All right, anyway, enough on ghee. $13 for eight ounces. <laughs> half our standard amount of salt. Half our standard amount of salt. Because there's also half our standard amount of water. I've talked to, to people and they are like dead in the morning. Like they just, they can barely function. Well, I think that they're losers. <laughs> These Macs are cooking fast because they're half size pouts. Half size pouts. <laughs> House is steamy. I told you. Oh. Uh, foggy. Oh, it's foggy. The first one is in the air all around us because it's water. Love. They do these pop-up sort of fairs in the parking lot at the mall. Yeah. They sell you like uneven amounts of tickets, so you'll need seven <laughs> tickets and they only come in tens and no ride takes three tickets. Classic carny technique. We're gonna be using my favorite butter carry gold. I wanna make sure the butter baseline is the best uh, boostable butter. <laughs> <laughs> Big beautiful butter baseline, boys. It smells sweet. Yeah. That's a phenomena. Do 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 do. Phenomena. Do 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 do. Phenomena. Do 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 do. With John Travolta, he hits his head or gets struck by lightning, and then he becomes super smart and dies. <laughs> Guys, you can't just spoil phenomenon on Bachman. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, right. our big experiment. Saving that one. Eggman. <laughs> Baby, you're a firework. Come on, show us what you're worth. Yeah. Make it go, oh, oh, oh. Cause you're replacing all the men. This baby you can have some egg. Give us your best wrestling celebrity. So Stone Cold I mean, maybe? Yeah, sure, that sounds great. Macaroni and cheese is a favorite comfort food for both children and adults. What? Unfortunately, many people are not able to tolerate gluten, dairy, and soy. <laughs> we can do the rest as Gilbert Gottfried. After years of recipe testing, we found delicious dairy-free diet cheese. Can you do that? How do you do it? This one snaps, yeah. then that one snaps, then you collapse. <laughs> you got it. And then faster. And then one after another. <laughs> Oh, yeah, no. Kids will innocently, you know, completely innocently say, why is he so fat, mommy? And the, the parents, I'm not offended, right? I, I know, I'm aware. And, and the parents get like, <laughs> they get so flustered, like, shh, shh. But why, mommy? I don't understand, shh, shh. <laughs> Don't silence me! The posture, yeah. <laughs> the posture. The posture. And I like that they have a website which makes it perfectly clear. Do you want to hear some of their category of products? I would love to. Potato side dishes. Rice side dishes. Okay. Skillet side dishes. Seems, seems really side dish focused. Dips, dressings, and soups. All right. Pasta side dishes. Okay. Sauces. Yep. Baking needs. Ooh. Stuffings. Okay. Gravies and seasonings. Very good. Breadcrumbs and coatings. Simply wonderful. I want to find it. I want to go to a, on a tour of the factory. Yeah, insist on a tour. Or we could show up with mustaches. You yeah. say that we're Chef Carlin here for- a I'm Chef Carlin and I'm Chef Carlin and we'd like a tour of the store. <laughs> All right, this way, Mr. Collins. How are you, John? Oh, I'm great, Frankie. Well, I've got AIDS, but other than that, I'm okay. <laughs> that is from Mr. Belvedere. <laughs> Hello, Danny. Is Wesley here? Yes, come on in. Everyone, you remember Wesley's friend, Danny? Oh, hi, Danny. Hi, Mrs. Owens, Mr. Owens. Hiya, champ. How's it going? Well, I got AIDS, but other than that, I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have AIDS, but other than that, I'm fine. Yeah, that, that was in the thick of the AIDS craze. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> Well, I gotta eat, but other than that, I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> That's concerning. They canned laughter it. They didn't use the big raucous. No. They used, like, the mid, the, the mid joke. <laughs> yeah, like, just the any joke. Yeah, like, the here's a joke. <laughs> I bet somebody sat in an editing room and there wasn't supposed to be canned laughter and it played so strange. They're like, throw it in. Well, I gotta eat, but other than that, I'm doing pretty good. That's like a situation a parent never wants to be in. Like, oh, your friend comes over and they say they have AIDS. Oh. Maybe it's not true. It would appear that Wesley's friend Danny is taking the piss. <laughs> <laughs> taking the piss. Danny's, Wesley's friend Danny. Claims to have had the AIDS. 
<laughs> Since I believe he's taking the piss. I don't believe it, madam. I think we ought to give the poor boy the ass. I'd say this is probably 45 seconds from completion. What can we talk about in 45 seconds, Frankie? Well, I have AIDS, but other than that. Insert slight canned laughter here. <laughs> <laughs> I think Junt should flood his home and have viewers come to do battle on small ships in his living room for the glory of the hat. Losers are forced to eat Loretta in shame. That's wonderful. I don't want to flood my house, though. As for leftovers, well, good luck. <laughs> what? You're oh. implying that there's not going to be any leftovers left. I thought they were saying to, <laughs> that we reheat poorly. <laughs> I have stopped buying Kraft three cheese and switched over completely to Walmart three cheese. Yeah. I compared just recently again, just to make sure that I wasn't losing my mind. You had a box mac show we didn't film. <laughs> yes, I was in the kitchen, I had it all set up, I had the pots. You were talking to the bathroom. Why is there garlic in the glass? It's just um, where I'm keeping my garlic as... Oh, all right. I do the same thing. Yeah? This is what gay men do? I went online, I went to Amazon. I spent an additional $80 beyond the MSRP to get a Switch. This is margarine. I don't know if it's any good. Oh, it's no good. It's no good. It's no good. It expired about a year ago. Box Mac, Box Mac, Box Mac, Box Mac, Box Mac, Box Mac, Box Mac. But all right, where are we start? Why never two cheese? Why does it always take three? You need yeah. the cheese of courage. Yeah, the, the cheese, cheese of wisdom and the cheese of power. Yeah. <laughs> so Link, fill up your hearts so you can shout your sort of power. I sh assume these are not official yeah. lyrics. Did you ever think when you eat Chinese, it ain't pork or chicken, but a fat Siamese. Ah, yes. yes, the food tastes oh, great, yes. so you don't complain. Cause that's not chicken in your chicken chow mein. Seems to me I ordered sweet and sour pork, but Garfield's on my fork. He's purring here on my fork. Dude, would you like the chorus? Oh yes, please. There's a cat in the cradle at the Peking room. Oh yes, Peking moon. A place that I eat every day at noon. They can feed your cat and you never know. Once they wrap it up in dough, boy, they fry it real crisp in dough. And, hey, I'm not that, I'm Big Bun. Exactly. <laughs> that was the that was internet comedy. That was comedy, right? folks. No, I not. <laughs> Everyone can see the road that they walk on is paved with gold. They wanted the highway. <laughs> so happy is old and grace today. today. It's got a bit of a almost smoky taste to it. EJ. Oh, it's weird. Yeah. Oh. It's got that sourness. It's got it's got beef stew. <laughs> In the words of Michael Keaton. Box Mac Roll Call. Nina. Vegan. EJ. Whiskey. This thing. Ingredient all chalk. No, I will not make out with you. Go on with the chlorophyll. Oh, no. Oh, no. Monster cheese, Gouda cheese, goat cheese, ingredient hole. Don't touch the ingredient hole. It's all in one. The strainer's in one. Don't as say well. anything so about we her have breasts. No extra dishes to clean. <clears throat> it looks fabulous. That is not like a studio kid. That is the size of a tangerine. Of These girls are too excited about living, but this is the way that girls are, isn't it? 
<laughs> Patriarchy. Craft cheese paste. It's yeah. like craft cheese paste. Craft cheese paste. AKA cream cheese. Oh. Mac and cheese stabbing. Which implies that someone tried to stab with a wet noodle. Who cook the macaroni for Rocky and Carlo? They loosen up and real good. Well, the man can't talk, but maybe he can cook a macaroni. <laughs> Making a mac and cheese, a Rocky and Carlo, a mac and cheese with an egg. A nice fall based pumpkin mac. The second episode of Jen's Cart Ever. We were at Savers. Yep. And we were looking at all the Halloween clearance, and you yep. came across one of these idiotic chicken costumes. That's right. And you said, They do have some cheaper costumes. Like this delicious chicken costume. I'm kind of hungry, so I said delicious <laughs> accidentally. <laughs> we're using mascarpone cheese. I think it's pronounced mascarpone. Is it? Mascarpone? Mascarpone. Like you're, have a, you're in Massachusetts, you have a car, and you have to pone. Mascarpone. How are you going to make sure that pumpkin goes well with a mac and cheese? By using a lot of cheese, basically. The craft keeper <laughs> and his new wife-to-be is a big decision to get in the chicken costume. EJ, tell me what the doctor tells you when you're know you looking for advice. They're yeah. like, what's important is what you want to do. That's right. Zach was the only one with the balls to be like, listen, I say go full chicken. I have confidence in pumpkin. I have right. confidence in cheese. I have confidence that Halloween will be tasty. Don't you just love a good cheese sauce? I do. Don't you just want to ruin it with breadcrumbs? Oh, we're no breadcrumbs in our recipe today. Ashley, where are you? We need a mac ruined. Where's Ashley's god now? Another, ooh, that's hot. Oops, careful, don't burn your <laughs> You need them. It's where you get your power. What's the point of this again? Just for textural juxtaposition? I like browned cheese. It's mostly cheesy. Yep. And there's a little tiny pumpkin little spice in there. Pumpkin. And it makes it kind of fun for the fall. Yes. I'd like that back. They love mac. And I like that back. I like that back. I like that back. Half spills down the Oh god. Oh god, I've had that happen, Frank. No, you haven't. On the show, I've lost four noodles. What? Hey, aren't you based on this thing? Oh my god. And handy mix. Oh god, turn it off. We don't want it to see its home. <laughs> What's going on? It kind of reminds me of the drug segments from Requiem for a Dream. It does, especially sped up. I'm a fop, you're the dandy. Uh definitely. And I'm a glorified pot. Uh When I sold it up, I gave it some thought. I was like, wow, that like, that wasn't even me. Like, that was like some other puppet skeleton. You know what I'm saying? Get off my head, get off my trunk, my stay still, stay still, guys, stay still. Ah, ah, what? Ah. Wait, have oh. something you need back. It's Twee, it's so Twee. So here's the gag. Yeah. It's a fiesta of Dino and Spiral Max. Oh, that's great. You refused to do six Max. Yeah, I did. Yeah. yeah. You're in the other room going, there's a not six. Not six, five, <laughs> not six. <laughs> if every word I said could make you laugh, I'd talk forever. Oh. <laughs> forever. Fiesta! <laughs> Butter usually has a couple months shelf life, so I don't check, but I've gotten uh, boned, to say, a couple times. Butter boned. <laughs> Macaroni and cheese. <laughs> Macaroni and, and some cheese. cheese. Macaroni and cheese mixed with butter and milk. Holy f f***ing sh it's, it's a dinosaur. dinosaur. Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ. what, what the, the f***? How do you feel about like a like a skill slowly rotting? Uh, I feel really positive about it. <laughs> I'm sure that if there was a bike that could fit my carriage, I could still ride a bicycle just fine. I think he was so embarrassed about it that he didn't want to get into the details. It's like legit, suffice it to say, I jumped off a roof. Yes, that's the kind of injury you lie about. Uh, a roof threw me off of it. Yeah, yeah. I had a I, I got hit by a small car, <laughs> yeah. a, a Shriners car. Nina got a scholarship from the Fiestas. And she is not Portuguese. She had to march in the fiestas. I will cut in a picture here. I have a photo somewhere. It's not much of a fiesta, I'd have to say. I'll say. More like a siesta. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try a dino. And by the way, this is dino piles. And there's like, <laughs> I see just one or two intact dinosaurs. I mean, nothing of the dinosaurs remains. But I, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> they say for a really good experience, do it in the microwave. For an incredible experience, do it in the oven. 
Do we want a really good or incredible experience? Incredible. Wait a minute, are you making all of them? Well, I'm not gonna make all of all of them, but I'm gonna make <laughs> some of all of them. We don't talk much about, uh, you know, frozen dough because we don't have a show called Frozen Dough. <laughs> we have a show called Boxer Back. Well, I don't know why I came here tonight. I got the feeling that something right. I'm so scared cause I got bagel and cream cheese. And I'm wondering what happened to his head. Clowns to the left of me. <laughs> you can just get right here. I am stuck, stuck in the middle with, with you. These are gonna need to cool for a few seconds or you'll burn your precious. These are all pretty good. I'm not even f***ing with you. Hashtag, we're not f***ing with you. The plant tail episode. Sure. You got some dirt on your- On, on your, my foot. <laughs> on your pants. The way it's cut, it looks, and I didn't mean for it to be this way, it looks like Matt is rushing over to brush it off. <laughs> 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 brushing the fupa is like, it's like brushing like, um. The mane of a horse. <laughs> Are you okay? It was a sneeze cough. You never had one? Craig, I propose that we never again cook a spiral macaroni and cheese on Box Mac. I know you do. <laughs> so I did over milk one of these a little bit. Don't talk about it. I really like what this. What the hell's going on? What is the cardboard taste? Was this not the cardboard one? No, I'm thanks. done with that. Yep. Matt B, how you doing, Matt B? You having a good day, Matt B? How you doing, Matt B? <laughs> Matt B, how you doing, Matt B? Having a good day, Matt B? How you doing, Matt B? Matt B, glow. Ooh, the chicken is reeking. The chicken is reeking. Reeking. Keith, chicken. the chicken is reeking. Keith, the chicken is reeking. Frankie, the chicken is reeking. Gloria, the, the chicken, chicken is reeking. reeking. I heard the chicken is reeking. Box Mac, exclamation point. Some might say it's chicken AF. That time on Box Mac. <laughs> Don't sing like Christmas if the mummers are not here. Granny would say as she'd knit in her chair. Good night and good Christmas, mummers, me dears. Please, God, we will see you next year. What about like a little chody tree like this one? This isn't too chody. I feel like I'm lost in a field of trees. <laughs> that is really funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing He's no. missing his headphones. Have you ever had a doll made of you? No. He's got rosy cheeks. <laughs> I, I, yeah. He's struggling with his oil levels a little. <laughs> you can fit like one, two, three Ninas. <laughs> Here's a mini alcoholic for scale. <laughs> Smell of lemon is making a rumbly in my tumbly. Where did you learn this, Russia? Uh, I spent a lot of time on the internet and Russia, yeah. Thank you, man. You're welcome. Servant, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Baby Glow. Baby Glow. Mama Nina. Uncle Angry. Cashews. Cashews, I love cashews. These are unsalted cashews. Frank, you try a cashew. Nina, would you like a cashew? A vegan cashew? We're just gonna say cashew all day. She has gone nuts. Three quarters of a cup, thank you. Three quarters of a cup, thank, thank you. you. Three quarters of a cup. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey, hey. So what's this recipe called? Junts nuts? Ju <laughs> Look, you don't need to go there because people on the comments are already going there. How did you feel about them? They were delicious. How so so then why is your interest in my nuts so low? Right. <laughs> you have 25 minutes to make the quack and bush. <laughs> when the fluid stops moving through the nuts, it's ready. What are the noodles made out of? Do you know? I don't know. It Gosh. might be marzipan. Uh, I just, I just effed it all up, the bag ripped. I'm sorry, <laughs> like this is like a snuff film or something for Nina. <laughs> why didn't we stuff mac and cheese into the turkey? Um, because oh. that would be f***ing gross and I won't do it. I cannot believe you guys have made 100 episodes all about reviewing macaroni and cheese. And have I watched all 100? Yes, I have. And will I hope that you make 100 more? Yes, I do. So here's to you, Chef's Hat. May angel babies carry you on high. It's babies. Angel babbies. Gold may be the hardest hue to hold, but I'll be damned if Old Hat didn't hold it until the bitter end. Godspeed, Old Hat, wherever you are. May the road rise up to meet you. May the win always be at your hat. This is the... It's a smoker. The first time this has been done? This is the first time you smoked a turkey. We're smoking a turkey. Uh, but he has smoked other things. Yeah. Ha ha ha, Merry Christmas. Happy end episode. Who's battle? We love you, Mark Snack. We love you, Mark Snack. All right, welcome to another episode of Glitter Bitches. <laughs> <laughs> I had guessed 
that someone might have stolen them off my porch, which is pretty sad. Yeah, he talk. starts going into this conspiratorial stuff. Yeah. And he's all bent out of shape. He's like, we're not going to have markers, <laughs> and, and we're not going to have stickers. Where will I find them at this hour? I guess I could go to Marshall's if I really, there's, there's many really have circumstances <laughs> that Frankie isn't expressing. This little thing kind of looks like War Turtle from Pokemon, so I'm making it a little bit. I don't know what it was supposed to be, but... I came all the way over here for the glue gun, and they keep grabbing it. Yeah. It's a hot commodity. That was a good yeah. joke. Two points for you. I kind of like where you've gone with this. It, it would be a terrible ornament, but. Could someone um, put a little water in there for me, please? Kirby, I guess. I mean, we could call him by his actual name. Sorry, what's his name? Dude. Andrew. You were introduced to him as angry. You should see some of those old angry Kirby videos where he's screaming at his audience. Yeah. Make it, oh, you can't do multiple names! Why does no one read the rules? Open the hole in the top so you can hang it, because you got to make it hangable. I do. Poke it out, poke it out. Poke it out, poke it out. This isn't going to work. Wow. I made this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it is. We should put it on the other tree because it would work bigger, better on a bigger oh, tree. It's really nice, but we should just not put it on this tree. We should put <laughs> it in the other room, away from where people Here, can't see it. Inside those cranberries was a magic gelatin. Happy 100th video. And happy holidays to Red Cow Entertainment fans. Aaron refuses to do this video for some reason. He's in a bad mood. I don't know what I'll find. That's all. You get to go sit down. Yep. Your favorite activity. I actually prefer lying down if we're going to get technical. <laughs> you guys have a lovely time. Yeah. Rest your feet, buddy. I will. Oh, baby. You seem a little apprehensive. <laughs> I'm definitely apprehensive. <laughs> Broil. Clear. Uh, there's only a few buttons here. Hi, Michael. This is Jonathan Hunt. Good. Um, there was just one thing to, to follow up on. After I got the OnStar set up, I talked to one of the sales managers there on the way out, and the car is missing the driver's side floor mat. What's John going on and on about? This is your boy Frankie coming at you with Matt and Angry Kirby. Yeah. Like and subscribe. Tickle that subscribe button. The carrots are in. The carrots are not my problem. Oh sure, a nice healthy snack. Try also apples with peanut butter. <laughs> Try also kiwis with peanut butter. Try also celery with peanut butter. Try Air. peanut butter with human hair. Are you familiar with what it looks like to be pregnant? I'm not. I like, like this. You got three lifelines. Hey John. What's up, Frankie? Shut up! All right. We got a roux going? You but... were at bechamel adding cheese. Yeah, sorry, I forget what the difference is. F***ing smug. F***ing hard. Yes! <laughs> 100 episodes! Woo! Yeah! What's inside? Carve a nice turkey. Don't burn your pressure, CJ. And we are talking about the tip of your <laughs> <laughs> That's how Isn't that what you've been meeting all this time? No! What is the nature of this feast? Just... This is for the Christmas special. Don't you watch the show? <laughs> 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 that happens in your own home. Hark, what's the noise? Up by the front door. Ready to mummers, there's plenty or more. more. Her old weathered face lightens up with a grin. <laughs> and in mummers, <laughs> Mother's to 100 episodes and maybe 100 more. <laughs> Definitely 100 more something. Something. Uh, it's a little too blue for me to consume. Yeah. I have a sensitivity <laughs> to to ser like super strong blue food dyes. Why blue specifically? I have no idea.